Let's check the one you here. Welcome to Random Unbox TV, and today I'll be reviewing the Journey Peter N. The Journey Peter N is a budget Android smartphone. It was launched in August 2019 with a decent body build when compared to the price. The Journey Peter N runs on Android 8.1 Oreo Go Edition and is powered by MediaGate MT6580 and a port core. 1.3 GHz. Before we go right into the full review, I would like to please subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification button so anytime I upload a new video, you get notified. I also like you to give us a like at the end of this video. So let's get right into the full review. So these are the content that comes with this device. It has a TP clear case, earphone, USB cable, screen guard charger, warranty card and the user information. For the design, the Journey P10 smartphone has an IPS LCD capacity touch screen that is capacitive and multi-touch that offers an interactive experience. The Journey P10 N supports a notch screen at the bottom of the panel with minimal bezel. The P10 N displays protected by a 2.5D cup glass screen. The Journey Peter name appears modern and fits into the later design trend for body smartphone like the Ule Note 7 Itel S15 Pro. The Journey Peter name design is good and easy to carry in hand. The body is made of plastic and it comes in gold, black, blue and red. The Peter name comes with three cameras. At the front, you have a water drop notch camera with a sensor used for face unlock. It has a dual camera at the back with an LED flash, a speaker grill at the bottom, below Johnny brand logo. On the right side of the Peter N, you get the volume rocker and the power button, while on the left side, it's completely plain. At the base, you will find a mic and a micro USB 2.0 port for charging the device. The top of the device has a headphone jack. Taking out the back cover of the Peter N, reveals the battery, the dual SIM card slot, and the micro SD slot. When trying to open the back cover of the Peter N, you should be careful not to break it. For the display, the Peter N features a 6.1 inch IPS LCD display and it weighs around 196 grams. The screen has a resolution of 600 by 1280 pixels and a 232 dpi pixel density. It has an aspect ratio of 16 by 9 and a screen to body ratio of 71 by 3%. For the camera, the Johnny p n comes with three cameras, dual camera, 8 megapixels and a 0.2 megapixel at the back with LED flash and one front camera, 5 megapixels for taking selfies. So some of the camera features include dual tagging, panorama, focal length of 2.2 aperture and PDAF. The PDAF means face detect autofocus. It means it has a specific autofocus sensor that estimates the distance of the subject and the lens is then focused on that distance. Taking a photo with the back camera in a well-lit environment, it manages to deliver pictures with excellent details. I tested out the front camera and the back camera for this device and also tested out the video feature. The back camera supports video recording at 720p at 30fps why the phone camera allows you to take selfie pictures, video recording, and also video calling. Selfies taken on the phone camera look good, but not perfect. So this is the phone facing camera for the G9. It looks a little bit washed up, but still looks okay. Actually, I'll go. 
For the face unlock, face unlock is part of the setup process where you get the journey p 10 m much like the fingerprint scanner. Using your face, you can quickly unlock your phone. During the P10M, we know when you light up your phone and unlock it and remember your face. For the memory, the Journey P10M comes with 1GB of RAM, 16GB of internal storage and a memory card slot expandable up to 32GB. For the performance, the Journey P10M smartphone runs on Android 8.1 Oreo Go Edition operating system and powered by 1.3GHz quad-core processor and features the Mali 400MP2 GPU. It runs on the Media Kit MT6580A chipset. For the full screen experience, the P10M is simply easy to navigate and performs smoothly without any problem while multitasking. Although while I was gaming on this device, I had the browser at the background. While the browser was on at the background, I was unable to game smoothly. The game lagged during gameplay. For gamers, it runs most games smoothly. You won't notice any lag while playing. That if you are running only the game on this device. Remember this device just comes with 1GB of RAM, so you shouldn't expect the best performance while gaming. I was able to test out Temporon 2 and Pog Mobile Lite. Both games perform above average. The face of log on the P10M feature is fast and reliable in most lighting conditions while I use this device. For the battery life, the Journey P10M comes with a non-removable 4000mAh battery without fast charging. The battery life on the P10M will almost take you throughout the day in a single charge without gaming before you juice up. You may get up to 8 hours of use before juicing up. The device doesn't have wireless charging. For the connectivity, the Journey P10 has all the connectivity options that the standard smartphone includes the GPRS, Edge, 3G, 4G, Voice LTE, Bluetooth, USB and so many other features. So who is this device for and should you buy this device in 2020? You should be able to get this phone around 2900 online. Although I got this phone from a fiscal store at Kedra. The Johnny p m is a budget smartphone. You shouldn't expect the best performance from it. Who is it for? The Johnny p is the phone for those that can't afford an expensive smartphone. It's basically for students and customers. It has nothing to really differentiate from other budget smartphones on the market. It's simpler than most of the budget smartphones to handle and has less great features to offer. So, I'll leave a link below on where you can actually get the device online. Please drop your feedback in the comment section below and I'll get back to you. And don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification button so anytime I upload a new video, you get notified. And also, don't forget to visit our website at randomonboardstv.com to get updates on the latest device and gadgets. Thank you.